myself Dr. Pradeep Kumar Amma, working as assistant professor in the Department of Pharmaceutical Chemistry at Kaili College of Pharmacy, Hubli. In this session, I will be discussing on the topic urinary tract anti-infective agents. Symptomatic presence of microorganism within urinary tract that is kidney, ureter, bladder and urethra associated with inflammation is called urinary tract infection. It may be of the following kinds. Urethritis, infection of anterior urethral tract leading to dysuria, urgency and frequency of urination. Cystitis, infection of urinary bladder leading to frequency and urgency of urination, pyuria and hematuria. Pylonephritis, infection of one or more kidney. Pathogenesis, four roots of bacterial entity urinary tract are first one ascending infection, second one blood borne spread, third lymphatogenous spread, fourth direct extension from other organs. First one ascending infection. It is the most common route. Organism ascend through urethra into bladder. The schematic representation of the same is given below. Organism colonize in perineal and periurethral areas. Ascend to bladder, kidneys. Then there will be an urinary tract infection. Hematogenous infection. Blood bond spread to kidneys occurs mainly due to Staphylococcus aureus. Hematogenous infection develops most often in immunocompromised patients, elderly or neonates. Lymphatogenous spread in men through rectal and colonic lymphatic vessels to prostate and bladder. In women, through periuterine lymphatics to urinary tract. Direct extension from other organs. Pelvic inflammatory diseases, genitourinary tract, fistulas. Clinical manifestations of urinary tract infection. Discomfort in voiding dysuria, urgency and frequent urination, pelvic discomfort, abdominal pain, pyuria, hematuria, fever and chills, smelly urine. Drugs used in the treatment of urinary tract infection. The first one is nalidixic acid. This is the structure of nalidixic acid. UPAC name is 1-ethyl, 7-methyl, 4-oxo, 1-8-naphthyridine, 3-carboxylic acid. Its mechanism of action is, it works by stopping the action of bacterial enzyme called DNA gyrase. This prevents bacterial cells from dividing and repairing thereby killing them. Adverse drug reactions associated with nalidixic acid are nausea, diarrhea, dizziness. Some of the brand names of nalidixic acid are Negram, Nalid, etc. Another important class of Urinary tract anti-infective agents is fluoroquinolones. Under that, the first drug is norfloxacin. This is the structure of norfloxacin. UPAC name is 1-ethyl, 6-fluoro, 4-oxo, 7-piperazine, 1-eel, quinoline, 3-carboxylic acid. Mechanism of action involves 
by inhibiting the DNA gyrase, which in turn prevents bacterial cells from dividing and repairing, thereby killing them. Adverse drug reactions are headache, dizziness, allergic reaction, stomach pain, diarrhea. Some of the brand names are noroxin, chibroxin, etc. Now we will see the synthesis of norfloxacin. It mainly involves four step synthesis. In the first step, 3 chloro, 4 fluoro, benzenamide, and diethyl 2 ethoxy methyl mevalonate undergo condensation to yield diethyl 2 3 chloro. 4 fluoro phenylamino methylene malvalonate. The product of the first step undergoes further reaction with diphenoxy compound in the presence of cyclopropane to yield ethyl 7 chloro 6 fluoro 1 2 3 4 tetrahydro 4 oxoquinoline. 3 carboxylate. Next, this compound on further treatment with diethyl bromine, triethyl amine in presence of sodium hydroxide yields 7 chloro 1 ethyl 6 fluoro 1 2 3 4 tetrahydro 4 oxoquinoline. 3 carboxylic acid. In the final step, this compound undergoes the condensation reaction with piperazine to yield norfloxacin. The second compound is ciprofloxacin. This is a structure of ciprofloxacin. Its UPAC name is 1 cyclopropyl 6 fluoro 4 oxo 7 piperazin 1 il quinoline 3 carboxylic acid the mechanism of action involved with this drug is it works by stopping the action of dna gyrase adverse drug reactions involve vomiting stomach pain nausea Diarrhea. Some of the brand names of this drug are Cipex 500, Ciplox 500. The next drug is Ofloxacin. This is the structure of Ofloxacin. Its UPAC name is 9 fluoro 37 dihydro. 3 methyl 10 4 methyl piperazine 1 eel 7 oxo 2 H 1 4 oxazino 2 3 4 IJ quinoline 6 carboxylic acid. Mechanism of action involves the stopping action of DNA gyrase. And this in turn prevents bacterial cells from dividing and repairing, thereby ultimately killing them. Adverse drug reactions involve headache, nausea, vomiting, stomach pain, diarrhea. Examples of the brand names are Oflovid, Carivid 200. Next example is levofloxacin. This is the structure of levofloxacin. Its UPAC name is 9 fluoro 2 3 dihydro 3 methyl 10 4 methyl 1 piperazinyl 7 oxo 7 H pyrido 1 2 3 DE 1 4 benzoxazine 6 
carboxylic acid mechanism action involves the stopping action of DNA gyrase which in turn prevents the bacterial cell from dividing and repairing thereby killing them adverse drug reactions involve headache nausea constipation diarrhea brand names are Zubiflox 500 Levosina 500 next example is sparfloxacin this is the structure of sparfloxacin its UPAC name is 5 amino 1 cyclopropyl 7 3R 5S 3 5 dimethyl piperazine 1 yield 6 8 difluoro 4 oxo 1 4 dihydroquinoline 3 carboxylic acid mechanism of action involves the inhibitory action of DNA gyrase which in turn prevents the bacterial cell from dividing and repairing thereby killing them adverse drug reactions involve headache nausea constipation diarrhea brand names are Zosper Spart etc next drug gemifloxacin this is the structure of gemifloxacin its UPAC name is 7,3-amino-methyl-4-methoxy-immunopyrimolidin-1-yl-1-cyclopropyl-6-fluoro-4-oxo-1-8-naphthyridin-3 carboxylic acid the adverse drug reactions associated with this drug are headache nausea constipation and diarrhea mechanism involve the drug inhibits the DNA gyrase which in turn prevents the bacterial cell from dividing and repairing thereby leading to the death of the organism brand names are gemitab gsin etc coming to the general mechanism of action of all the fluoroquinolones They block bacterial DNA synthesis by inhibiting bacterial topoisomerase 2 which is also known as DNA gyrase and topoisomerase 4. Inhibition of DNA gyrase that is topoisomerase 2 prevents the relaxation of positively supercoiled DNA that is required for normal transcription and replication inhibition of topoisomerase 4 probably interferes with separation of replicated chromosomal dna into the respective daughter cells during cell division After the discussion, it is essential to know some of the frequently asked questions on this urinary tract anti-infective agents. Some of them are listed here. First one, classify urinary tract anti-infective agents with suitable examples and write the synthesis of norfloxacin. Second one, 
write the synthesis and mechanism of action of norfloxacin third one write structure and mechanism of action of norfloxacin fourth write structure and mechanism of action of one urinary tract anti-infective agent fifth one write the structure and mechanism of action of ciprofloxacin sixth write the structure and use of ofloxacin and nalidixic acid thank you